Yeah, of course, you want to finish the series on a high, but every game from now on until the Champions Trophy is going to be um, a stepping blocks for us to going into that huge competition. So um, we've got a huge amount of positives to take from the last two games. Uh, we, we, Although we got outplayed, we, we put in some serious performances. We got 350 in the first game and 370 in the next game and, and lost both of them. So um, the positives to come out of that are amazing. Uh, we got outdone by some individual performances that were outstanding. Yeah, uh, <clears throat> on both occasions, needed to stay in and, and get big hundreds. I was able, I should have done that. Um, that was the plan. Um, but obviously, that, it didn't work out that way. But like I said, our batting unit got us to 350 and 370 on both occasions. So I guess, I mean, I'm never happy with just a good start. A good start is a good start. But winning games for England is obviously at the forefront of my mind, so I've got to be a bit disappointed to be getting out in 70 and 80, yeah. No, we have batted together a couple of times, um, played against each other a lot, and yeah, he's a fiery batsman, he's an awesome player. Um, if he gets if he gets the role of, of number two, then that'll be great. He's, um, he's a great guy to bat with, runs hard, um, plays strong shots, and that's exactly what we look for at the top of the order, just to set the tone. Uh, there's nothing wrong with our team, mate. We're, uh, we're training very hard, we're all in good spirits, we're having a good time. Um, but like I said before, mate, we've been undone by some uh, incredible individual performances. Uh, so, mate, we're confident. We're still high and confident. We're a confident side. And no matter what we come against, we're, we're always pretty confident. So we'll be all right.